I'm Alicia Pocock here at Baltimore Festival. Today's episode is all about food and drink. Today, Extra is playing host to some of the world's biggest music acts right here in our little city. Good, actually, I'm going to get a bit close to you because my arm doesn't stretch that far. There we go. So I'm here with Wildwood Kin, who have just performed an electric set. It was pretty incredible. You look like you were having fun. How was it? Yeah, it was great. Fun. Hello and welcome to X Media's coverage of the US presidential election 2016. So you do drums, piano, guitar, all in one set, and obviously yeah. singing. Do you yeah. think you ever expand that? Get like a saxophone in there? Or yeah, mate, if I can play the saxophone. <laughs> do you feel that TV has a place and even a duty to kind of bring these typically taboo subjects into a more public conversation? What about these people over here? Do you think over here? Um, do you want me to hold that, by the way? You, yeah, you look good. So although all of our freshers are assembling into one place this weekend, they do in fact come from all corners of the globe. Where are you from? France. France? Guys, where are you from? I'm from Jersey. Jersey, great. Island life, love that. Malaysia. Oh, okay. Cyprus. Cyprus. <laughs> Japan. Japan. India. I picked a good group. You get married? Yeah, I get married. When do you get married? I'm getting married in two weeks. Two weeks time, everyone. You I'm, his best, man. I'm his best He's man. I'm his best man. He's the best man. Guys, this is a special moment. And so that you don't get bored of our faces, we'll be mixing up the presenters every two hours, as well as bringing you the roundup room on an hourly basis, so you can keep up to date with everything that is going on. Is this the stag do? This is it. No. Is this the well, we, we went to Budapest for the stag do, and it was unreal. But so this is the second stag do. How does this compare to Budapest? Better, it, it, right? No, 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 no. It's not as good. No. But it's it's still good though, it's still good. Do you think that it's like this anti-establishment fed up with the system feeling that has been brewing under the surface for a while and actually it's just taken someone like Trump to expose that and give it a platform? Exeter's mitigation policy has been criticised by students across the university for inconsistencies the Guild has dubbed unacceptable. Kentucky and Indiana have gone to Trump and Vermont has gone, Vermont, that's not a state. Vermont <laughs> is a state and that's gone to Clinton. I've been Alicia Pocock, this was the Black Thistles. Oh, that fucking hurt! <laughs> I wouldn't do it. First correction, armed. Second correction, not a bomb. That's not... An engagement ring. No. Looks like one. Yes. I can ask you to let me do this forever. I was doing this for you. Yeah. I'm only... Today is not the day to test my patience. Today is not the day to charm me, to bring up old memories like it was yesterday, and it certainly isn't the day that you get to swagger in here, save the day, and be back home in time for tea. You don't get to do that. Not this time, not on my watch. Hiya! So I do want to just quickly ask Tristan to check. That's a big one. So that was a lot of fun. Glad you enjoyed it. How might someone get involved if they fancy a bit of slack lining? Uh, you can come along to our store at Freshers Fair tomorrow on yeah. Saturday. It's only five pounds to join, one of the cheapest societies on campus. So the Lemon Grove is arguably Exeter's finest <laughs> nightclub and we are lucky enough to have it right here on campus. How would you sum up the Lemmy in one word? Actually I'll give you three. It's not good. We're gonna get smashed tonight, Freshers Week. Big night. Really good, thank you, really good. Yeah, okay. good. Oh, good. Hillary Clinton or Donald Trump? Donald Trump is a twat. Hello, Hinton. Uh, Donald Trump. What's the political situation in Russia? Owen Smith or Jeremy Corbyn? How do you feel about the reintroduction of grammar schools across the UK? I do like it. Let's talk about Santa. Oh, yeah, bless him. I feel so sorry for him this time of year. He's got so much on his plate. Yeah. Food Queen, Alicia Pocock, won both challenges, and I am now on my way to Michelin star status. Am I doing this? Oh, yes, yes, it's so happening. Oh. Sometimes I wonder what, what he would do if he just got something really bad, like chlamydia, and he had to call in sick on Christmas Eve. Like, yeah, um, he's not a real chin. He's his sisters, yes. one cousin. Yes. Yeah. And have you got any other like, talented siblings in the family? Is there like, yes. others that didn't make the cut? <laughs> <laughs> we are back tomorrow for a day full of drama and all the art. I've been Alicia Pike up with Jack Garrett here at BBC Radio 1's Big Weekend. We've been XTV and you've been watching Baltimore Festival 2016. Over and out.